hello guys today in this video I'm going to demonstrate the output finding questions and their answers and I will uh, demonstrate the answer on the on the browser okay so please put your notepad and write down the questions and the answers according to your like analysis of the question so let's start the video okay so this is the first question and here I, you will get the 15 seconds so now the time starts as you know the time is completed now so I will copy it from here and open the sublime editor and here is the script and here I will put my code and now it is I have saved the code the file and now I will refresh here the page so you can see here the output is 10 so please make sure that you are matching the answer okay so now let's move to the next question which is question number two and here again you will have 15 seconds now the time is completed so let me again here copy this code and put it here in the sublime so I hope you would have calculated the answer yet and now I will go ahead in the browser and refresh this page so you can see here I am getting the answer two times false then third one is true and again fourth one is the false okay so now let's move to the next question which is question number three and again you will have 15 seconds so now time is completed so let me copy it and go to the sublime editor and I will paste it here and I will refresh the browser so here you can see two times zero and one time two is coming the output okay so now let's move to the question number fourth and again you are having 15 seconds and the time starts now Okay, the time is completed now so I will go ahead and copy it from here and I will paste it here in the sublime okay now I have saved it and I will refresh the browser so you can see here the output is number that means type of test method is number okay so now let's move to the next question which is question number five and you are having again the 15 seconds and now time is completed so I will copy it and move to here sublime and then I will paste it here and then I will refresh the page so you can see here the type of type 10 is a string okay so the first one was the number and type of number is like this this is the type of 10 is the number but type of number when we calculate that will come the that will be the string so that's why we are getting the output here a string okay so now let's move to the next question which is question number six and here it is the question and here again you will have the 15 seconds
now time is completed so I will copy it here and go ahead and I will paste it here and now I will go here and I will refresh the page so you can see this is coming like this means what it has done you can see here it has divided the complete or or expanded the complete string into the single single characters okay so you can see its total length is 10 and it is starting from the 0 to 6 okay so now let's move to the next question which is question number 7 and here again you are having the 15 seconds So now time is completed so I will copy it and go ahead in the sublime and I will paste it here and then I will go ahead here and refresh the page and you can see the output which is 180180 okay that means what it has done it has multiplied the first two elements then what is the, the result is then again multiplied by 3 okay and then again the result is multiplied by 5 and then again the result is multiplied by 6 okay so uh, like that we are getting the output is 180180 so now let's move to the next question which is question number 8 and here is the question and again you are having the 15 seconds to calculate it and now time is completed so I will go ahead here copy it now I will paste here the code and save it and I will refresh the browser so you can see here the answer is 4 times true then 3 times false and then again true so here is the main thing let me take you to the code here so you can see here this is the double equals to it always compares the value that's why the value of one as a number or a string is the same in the same way false and the value of zero is the same true and value of one is the same one and one string is same so that's why we got the four times true but here if it will put here three times equal that means it compares value as well as the type so you can see here the number is dif different type and this is the string type same here this is boolean and this is string so boolean and string but in the last again the value is same okay value and type that's why we got the true okay so now let's move to the next question which is question number nine here again you will have 15 seconds and the time is have started so I hope you will be calculating the answer on your paper so now time is completed so let me copy it and go to visual studio so we go to sublime and paste it here and now I will refresh the page after saving and you can see we got the true and false okay so why is that because again here the this value is number and its value is object okay so once we put two double compare then the value becomes similar okay but when we put three equals that means it compares value as well as the type so the number uh, type is different as it is one is object and other is number so that's why second we got the false okay and now let's move to the next question and this is the last question which is question number 10 and here again i will start the timer now time is completed so i will copy it and go to sublime and here i will 
paste it and I will refresh the page now okay so you can see here here what we are doing here this is the output so let me just explain this so here what we are doing the first position 0 1 and 2 we are having 1 2 3 numbers right but at the 10th position we have inserted or assigned a value 20 but the rest of the numbers like from uh, from from 3 to 9 right it is empty so that's why <coughs> you can see here in the browser we are having 0 1 2 position value and then 10th position we have the value but you can see in between empty 7 7 um, 7 positions are empty okay so that's why we are getting this so this is the final answer of this question okay so that's all guys in this video for now so thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you